from the top. Okay. Drop that. Yeah. Feel the funk, y'all. What's up Hoopers, it's Coach Alex from Think Pro Basketball and in today's video we're going to go over the Kyrie Irving spin move tutorial. Let's get started. A spectacular move! All right, guys, like I said, we're going to go over a couple Kyrie Irving spin moves in today's video. We're going to do one where you just spin and finish at the rim, and then we're going to use one where we spin off of our dribble right into our jump shot. So the first one we're going to work on is getting to the basket. But before we do that, make sure you hit that subscribe button and join Think Pro Basketball. Now, I've got a chair out here just to kind of illustrate a defender or something that is going to allow me to spin off of to work on my spin move. Okay, so with Kyrie Irving, unless if he's gonna shoot a jump shot, his spin move is tight, right? Meaning like he attacks this chair or this defender here, and he's not spinning and spinning out here to finish. He's attacking your hip, spinning right off of you and getting right where he wants to go. So he'll get here, he'll attack, boom. But now when he spins off of you, it's so quick and tight, <laughs> boom, he's here. And now he's finishing right at the basket rather than outside of the key. So it's important that when you're working on this that you're doing the same thing, whether you're spinning to your left or spinning to your right, that you make a move at this chair, boom, you spin, and you go right at the basket to score. Another thing you have to do is be able to protect the basketball. Rarely you will see Kyrie Irving use a spin move and lose the ball, because when he spins, that ball is either protected here or it's protected where he's extended it away from the defender who's on his hip that now if they reach, it's away from them to score at the rim. All right, and you have the, also the ability to keep that ball in the same hand. So if I have the ball on my left and I spin, I could keep it here, right? Or I could spin and switch it to be able to finish at the basket. So those are a couple of key points that you have to be able to work on and figure out what is best for you, what are you most comfortable with when using the spin. So what I would suggest when you use this drill is get a chair, put something in the middle of the paint and work on spinning both directions. Attacking the basket, scoring right at the rim. Try to keep it as tight as you can to that chair so you can finish as close as you can to the basket. All right, so this is the first move again of two. We're gonna spin and finish at the rim. Check it out in full speed. Life was the rock of mic in front of you spectators and rock shell toes, not gators. Show love, not haters. I'm switching over like cross faders to a better time and place where it's safe. And they can't judge a nigga by the color of his face, but by the content of the way that I spit these letters. I'm kicking it with white boys and old navy sweaters. Ball cap low on my eye, cause sometimes I'm listening to my style so much. I'm just trying to get by. All right, Hoopers, we're going to move on to the next move of Kyrie Irving's spin tutorial. And now with this, we're going to get into our jump shot. So we're spinning off of the dribble, avoiding a defender who's trying to reach in. So that's what we're going to put this chair here again for. Let's just say that the defender's here and they try to swipe through to steal the basketball. So when you see that happen, you know, you have your ability and your, you know, your ways to go here and def defend the basketball. You know, you can retreat away from it, but the spin move is also a great move to help avoid that steal. So if the defender tries to swipe at, boom, you just spin right off of them and you get to your jump shot. Now here's a couple key tips. When you spin, if you're gonna spin and keep the ball in the same hand, right? So if I spin and I keep the ball in my right hand, it's important that I push the ball out. So when I spin, I get away out here into this area where I can get right into my jump shot. Okay, if I'm gonna keep the ball, if I'm gonna put the ball in the other hand, I can spin tight and right off of the defender. The reason I say that if you spin with you and keep the ball in the same hand and go wide is just in case that defender is able to recover enough to poke the ball away. And if that ball is in that inside hand, it's easier, but if you push it out and away from them, it's better for you to protect the basketball. So what we're going to work on now is spinning into our jump shot. So I want you to attack the chair. We're going to spin. So when we spin, you can do one of two. Keep it in the same hand or switch hands. Boom, but you're not gonna take another dribble. After that spin, you're gonna spin right into your jump shot. So right when you come off of that spin move, you're right into your shot, okay? So the only dribble you get after that is you spin, one dribble, jump shot, bang. All right, so we're spinning off a defender trying to steal the basketball from us. 
we get right into our shot right after the spin. All right, this is move number two, the final move in today's video. Check it out in full speed. I'm just saying, for real, I'm just saying. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to welcome you all out to a musical extravaganza called the Night and Day Project. Please save your applause to the end. I'm in the AC, cooler than I ever was. I went from bubbling to a better buzz. Hey, check this cuz, I did it with no airplay. Wild out in the lot, well, that's hearsay. I'm just trying to do my thing, shine like a star. Skills in the place, better, you know who we are. All right, Hoopers, that's it for today's video. A couple of moves to break down Kyrie Irving's spin, whether you're finishing at the rim or spinning right into your jump shot. If you enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, let us know what you think. Most importantly, hit that subscribe button again to join Think Pro Basketball and get all the great content that we release every single week designed to help you improve your game. Now, until I see you again next time, hit the gym, hit the court, put the work in, and remember to always keep hooping.